Well, what's up to all my chicken grease junkies out there in YouTube land? This is Fast Jimmy 71 coming at you from the Chicken Grease Garage. Well, hope everybody's having a wonderful day today. Today's Sunday. Uh, here in Chi Town, it's eh. Uh, it rained all day yesterday, so it wasn't that great. Uh, today, the sun is coming out. Uh, it's going to probably be about 70, 75 degrees. Eh, okay, day. Uh, well, Enough for the weather. I'm not a weather reporter. <laughs> um, I'm just here to say a big thank you to Little Joe and CT Speed Shop, man. My two brothers, my two uh, southern brothers. Uh, man, you, you guys blew my mind when you did that video. I can't believe <laughs> uh, all those, those years of uh, making videos and the memories and... Oh my God, the, the the stuff that I did, oh my God, it's hilarious, you know, just to see my mug for the first time on video and and uh, just, just the memories, man, it's just incredible. I haven't gone back into seeing all my, uh, my videos, you know, going into my archives to look at my videos because uh, I haven't had a chance to, but... Uh, that was an awesome video, man. It, it, it brought tears to my eyes, man, because, you know, a lot of those parts in those videos were times where, you know, I was having a lot of hard times and a lot of good times and, you know, a mix of different things were, were you know, in that video that brought back memories for me. Uh, so it was, it was a good video and I thank him from the bottom of my heart, dude both of you man for coming up with this video uh thank you uh that was awesome well uh now the t-shirts i know you guys are probably sick and tired of hearing about these t-shirts um i'm right now we we figured out the the paypal thing you know you gotta understand i'm this is my first time doing this uh the paypal deal is already been fixed uh you can send your orders through through my uh, my uh, email uh, what's your address and everything and I will try to get your packages out as soon as I can uh, I got a couple of people that I still have to send stuff out to you know but you know it's kind of hard for me to juggle work and all this other stuff so please give me some time give me a chance but you will get your t-shirts uh, um, and that's all I have to say about that um, now I have a little something that I got to show you guys. It's something that I did a while back called uh, King Dunk. Uh, that thing was ridiculous looking. I can't believe I even built something like that. Um, it was a kit that I bought for a couple of bucks. I think I paid $3 for that kit and it was missing a lot of parts and just, it was, you know, it was a junky kit, you know, uh, it had the body, the chassis, uh, a couple of parts and stuff. It was a 70 uh, Chevy Impala. Uh, I didn't know what to do with it, so I turned it into a big dunk car. Uh, and I, for me, I'm not into dunks. But I said, uh, you know, why not? You know, I'll do something different. Uh, well, I, I built it as a dunk, and I hated it. I mean, I hated it. I hated it. I hated it. Um, it was ridiculous looking. It was stupid looking. I'm, I'm sorry, but for me, I'm not into dunks. You know, um, uh, I don't, I don't want to offend anybody that, that likes dunk cars. For me personally, I don't like them. Um, but I had to change it up a little bit. So I took the tires off of it and uh, I put a different suspension on it. Uh, through my parts box and stuff I just threw it together you know it's a it's a it's a parts car anyways you know it's it was put together by different parts of different cars different engine different everything so uh, you know it's a, it's just thrown together car you know I came up with that idea I didn't care for it tires were ridiculous looking I took them off uh, suspension didn't make no sense uh, to me uh, now it didn't make any sense took all that down uh, put a different suspension and um, I'm just gonna stop talking about the car and I'm just gonna show you what I did to it so uh, it's still within the dunk realm but it's not 
ridiculous looking like it was in the past. So I'm going to turn this video around. I'm going to show you what it looks like now. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. And here she is again, King Dunk. Um, I changed up the suspension on it. I put the suspension from a, uh, what is it, those, uh, either it was a Cadillac or a Cadillac Dunk or the Caprice Dunk. I had some uh, spare parts. Uh, so I put those spare parts on this car. Um, I took the, the suspension that it had, I took it off. Uh, as you can see, all the little white marks and stuff that's on the bottom. That's where the suspension was sitting. So I took all that out. I didn't bother painting it, you know, because for one is I don't have a paint that matches this because I painted this uh, with the rattle can. Uh, so I don't have any paints to match that color. So I just left it like that. You know, this is, this was a, a, a card that I just put together just to put it together you know uh, so I'm not making such a big deal out of this um, it is a 70 Chevy Impala uh, the rims and tires are from a die cast car uh, suspension like I said is from the one of the, the dunk series uh, from Ravel uh, engine is from a seven, uh, what is it, 1967 uh, Chevy Malibu, I think it is. Yeah, I think it's a Malibu uh, because the engine it didn't bring it. So I detailed the engine. I did some, you know, wiring and stuff. You know, the wires are too big. You know, I didn't have any wire, spark plug wires. So I made my own distributor with these fat ass wires. <laughs> <laughs> these wires are huge uh, they're, they're out of scale uh, you know it's just something I put together man it's just like no big deal it's missing the windshield it, it, I had the windshield for it and when I took it apart I don't know what I did with it so I'm going to have to make me another windshield uh, out of probably some plastic or something but for right now it's just going to stay like that um I do like the interior though, you know, I think I did pretty good with the interior, you know, I made that uh, that uh, center armrest because this was a, a whole bunch, a whole bench seat. So I'm going to show you uh, what it does. As you can see, it goes up. So it's... Uh, it's a bench seat. It was actually a bench seat when I got it. I cut all that open, sealed it up, and I made the, the little uh, armrests with the pins and everything for it to go up and down. Uh, and it goes up and down. So there's, uh, there's the armrest. Bam. Got that ginormous speaker box in the back. No back seat. Uh, chain steering wheel. TV in the dash, got this crazy looking tiki head shifter, back window, you know, it, it's, see as you can see, look at the, the marks of where I had the suspension before, you know, it's a, it's a whatever kind of car, you know, it's, you know, I just threw this thing together just for the hell of it, you know, because it was sitting in the box and I didn't know what I was going to do with it. You know, it was missing a lot of parts. I, I actually made this into a T-top. Um, so, you know, hey, like I said, man, I, I personally, I'm not into dunk cars, you know, but I said the hell with it. I'll just make one. Uh, like I said, again, please don't take this personally. I, I respect the art of dunk dunk cars because they put a lot of time and effort into building these things but me personally I don't care for them uh, it just it's just they're not they're not my style of car uh, but you know I put this one together you know just 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 for the hell of it and the tires I think it looks a little better drop down like this it looks more rideable <laughs> than uh, the way it was originally put together with those ginormous uh, uh, monster tires that, that stood up about that big, which uh, were really corny to me. Uh, but at the time, I didn't think so. So I guess uh, I grew out of that. 
<laughs> but um, yeah, man, that's that's what I got here. King Dunk is back. Uh, just a little, a little less, uh, a little less donkey. <laughs> <laughs> so it's uh it's uh it's still considered to be a dunk i guess you know uh because it's still raised up and it's got the big tires and rims and stuff but uh it's you know like i said it's not my style so uh no disrespect to all the dunk brothers out there hey man you keep riding and you keep doing your thing uh but this this is uh not my style of car uh, but uh, I built it for the hell of it. So, with that said, this is uh, Fast Jimmy Seventy One saying peace, and you know it, chicken grease. No. Later.